I look terrible with glasses, by the way, but in less than a minute later, like 20,000 people are calling you. You have one job tip. All you need to do is carry this to the car, right side up. If I was to have something like this with water, you know, close by, I would have to have like a fence. burning I don't know why I have no idea why they're burning <laughs> but they've been burning for a while now <laughs> anyways so I'm at work and I'm just finishing up actually I already finished but um online looking up open houses in the area that I could visit one of them I actually went to this place once looking to rent from them they never called me back is this the same no I don't think that's the same place no, never mind. That's not the same place. But this is a townhouse. This isn't like a real house. But it still would be fun to go and see it. There's another one. It's going to be opening in the next 10 minutes. Ugh, these prices are ridiculous though. This is why I can't, I can't buy a place here. This is ridiculous. There's no way. There's no way. Gosh, why am I even wasting my time? I want to go to at least one though. To request um, an open house, all of them are saying by like 2.30. That's a little late, isn't it? Yeah, all of these are saying 2.30. I'm going to be home by 2.30. What I'll do is, because the ones that I'm looking at right now, they're all close to my job. I'm going to look for some close to home so maybe I can just walk to it um, while I'm home later when I'm doing my steps. Let's see if they have any. Okay, let's see what we have here. I'm really excited about this new thing that I found. Um, I'm trying to look into the USD loans where you can like live basically in like rural areas. And they have that in places where I want to move to. I just found one on the little map that they give on their website, the USD website. I look terrible with glasses by the way, but I'm excited like I'm so excited to like really be like really really serious about this whole finding a home shindig but um okay let's see there's one here it says 11 to 1 but that doesn't make any sense this is requested tour as early as today at 2 30 p.m but it's from 11 to 1 p.m it doesn't make any sense it's not making any sense I'll figure it out and get back to you. Okay. Yes, I understand. Okay. All right. See you at one thirty. Yes. Uh, you're welcome. Bye bye. You give your information out online, and less than a minute later, like twenty thousand people are calling you. I gave my phone number to two websites and they already called me it's been like four minutes i got like three emails and like five phone calls bruh so i got something to eat something low in sugar most asian food except for chinese food um is actually good to eat uh, when it comes to low sugar and carbs i ordered from this restaurant like right down the street from my job and i should have my phone on the charger one second <laughs> I don't even know how long this video is going to be today. Yeah, I tried this restaurant place right down the street from my job. And it's pho. I added the pho to my bag. And then I also added... Uh-oh. Dropping things. I knew I was going to do that. And I also put spring rolls in there. And then I saw the price. I was like, <laughs> heck no. <laughs> so I took the spring rolls out and... I just have the pho. I haven't had pho in a very, very long time. But here we are. This is a what, 
What is it called? I just threw the receipt down. Where it be at, son? It's not on my receipt. It's probably on my, in my email. Well, this is what she's looking like. This is a little salad. I didn't know that came with a salad. Or is that something I'm supposed to put in the pho? Cause usually I eat it inside the restaurant, so I'm thinking like this is just the stuff I have to add myself instead of them doing everything for me. <laughs> give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. You have one job to, all you needed to do was carry this to the car, right side up. And this will probably be my last meal for the day too. Just cause I didn't go grocery shopping. <laughs> oh yeah, that's exactly what happened. Everything was not included. At least they gave me a fork and chopsticks because your girl be struggling sometimes. And they already knew. Mm, it smells so good. It's like white, white meat chicken or something like that. I think that was the name of the dish. Let me go ahead and put all of these ingredients together. I'm always afraid that I'm gonna like accidentally break this in half instead of breaking them apart. Yeah, buddy. I haven't had pho in so long. It's been at least like four years. Yeah guys, I know I've been Oh, you guys are blinking, don't blink! Don't blink! Okay, um, I'm gonna let you guys go because I'm getting, I'm getting ready to go and see the house. I was hoping that I'd be able to take you guys along with me, but even if this doesn't work, I will try and vlog from my phone. But um, yeah, I was gonna, that was gonna discuss with you the HOA fee nonsense and stuff like that. I, have, I typically don't look for places with HOA, but this place does. I'll, I'll get into it once you guys are fully charged. To, like pick and choose like you pick and choose. what you can settle with and what not if I was to have something like this with water you know mm -hmm. close by would have to have like a fence a gate a lock <laughs> everything <laughs> guys I just saw like the biggest piece of food like on my chin and I'm there with the realtor the whole time and didn't even know <laughs> that's so embarrassing hopefully she thought it was some kind of mole or something <laughs> she did say I was pretty so <laughs> anyways um I don't know how there's juice left in you guys because before I turned you guys off before I was showing the house I didn't it was blinking, but you guys aren't blinking now. Anyways, let me talk. Okay, so it was fun, like technically looking at my first home with this whole house by thing. Yay! I used to pass that that house all the time, townhouse, whatever, um, all the time when I was leaving school, like high school and stuff. And I'm like, I'm gonna live there someday. I'm gonna live there someday. Just something about it was just like, it just looks so peaceful and stuff. But is not definitely not the dream house that I'm looking for as nice as it was it's not the dream house I'll tell you a few things that I didn't like about it one it had a one car 
carport can't even say garage because it's a carport it's on the outside only one car for three bedrooms why why is there three bedrooms and only one car can basically fit there it makes no sense so yeah that's that's de that's a big no um another big no is that there is a lake there's a lake in the back and i have a phobia with having pools and lakes and rivers and stuff around where you dwell i have my reasons maybe someday i will get into details as to why um i'm i just i don't like those things one one of these days i'll tell you guys but i didn't like that um and it has nothing to do with florida and it's alligators <laughs> i can hear the alligator um you guys are starting to blink again and three the biggest issue that i have with the place is the hoa i don't like hoa and it has an hoa and not only does it have an hoa it's a billion dollars like it's 530 dollars for the hoa like that is pretty much like paying rent on top of everything else so that is a no-go place is nice but it's definitely not my dream house and even if i wanted to build a huge gate or fence or whatever like from the lake to the house you can't because hoa wouldn't allow it so that's a big fat no but it was still nice looking at the place people were great all the people that came in to see the thing they're all nice and polite but unfortunately that's not our dream house guys this is not our dream house but it's okay it's okay we will find it